this for Senate Bill 610, condominium, associate, condominium associations by Senator Pizzo. You're recognized to explain the um, bill. Thank you, Mr. Chair and members. Uh, committee substitute for Senate Bill 610 amends uh, Florida Statute 718, triple 11 relating to condominium associations. It prohibits particular activity um, and it does enumerate uh, four instances or events which would result in uh, criminal penalties. Uh, it also uh, replaces the existing forgery section as it relates to elections and replaces it uh, with a more practical uh, application of the law as it relates to uttering, which I'm happy to explain uh, the significant differences. There, uh, there is an amendment, Mr. Chair. There is one late filed amendment. Is there any objection to taking up the late filed amendment? Seeing none, um, let's take up amendment barcode 702520 by Senator um, Pizzo. You are recognized to explain the amendment. Thank you, Mr. Chair. 702520 uh, simply inserts language as it relates to timeshares. Uh, it says uh, not including timeshares, which makes it uh, consistent with existing language as it relates to, to timeshares. Are there any questions on the amendment? Seeing none, there are no. Is this on the amendment? There is it, uh, um, Gary Hunter with American Restore and Development Association. You are recognized. Wave and support. Thank you. Um, is there any debate on the amendment? Um, Senator um, Pizzo waves his close. All in favor of the amendment say yay. yay. All opposed say nay. Show the amendment is adopted. There are appearance forms on the um, bill as amended. Mark Anderson, you're recognized. Thank you, Chairman. Mark Anderson representing community association managers today across more than 14,000 associations in our state, uh, representing more than 6 million Florida homeowners reluctantly. And I, there you are, Senator Pizzo. We've um, had an ongoing dialogue with the Senate sponsor of this bill. I'm um, disappointed to say we've not been able to reach an agreement. We have supplied some language to him to clarify some of this. But if I may, Mr. Chairman, with your indulgence, I just want to go back for one moment and review why we have to oppose this bill today. 2017, uh, then Senator Representative Pepe Diaz and Senator Garcia introduced legislation that instituted and introduced a, a range of sweeping new penalties on bad actors for doing things in Miami-Dade County that are the subject of this bill. It was brought to the attention of the legislature by a grand jury report which highlighted a number of problems. Um, our associations, our managers were on the front lines of that engagement with those sponsors. That bill passed with our support with our in involvement uh, and with our support. Last year, Senator Pasadomo um, introduced a very good bill with our support uh, that we worked on to further clarify and to reinforce those new criminal and civil penalties that were introduced and passed the prior year. The bill, unfortunately, this year, um, and by the way, let me just finish that thought. We, have, we, we need to take a breath. Those are sweeping reforms that took place. We are just now creating new websites. There is tremendous criminal liability attached to making mistakes from those websites that is already in law. We feel as if a lot of these are volunteer board members who are going to be accused of things that in our view will be weaponized accusations for which there is now a criminal penalty. Um, we have, some, we have some, some serious concerns about this bill today and it's not because we haven't, had, we haven't tried. We certainly do and I respect where Senator Pizzo is coming from. But members, I just want to remind you, you passed a sweeping range of reforms two years ago that were then reinforced last year and we just have again we just have respectful but very significant concerns with this bill today mr chairman thank you um travis moore you are recognized waves in opposition i'm richard pinsky um, with cyber citizens you're recognized and he is waving in support um, okay, that is the um, public appearances. Um, is there any debate on the bill as amended? Senator Farmer, you're recognized. Yeah, uh, thank you, Chair. And, um, you know, I, I, I've been a little activity back here. We've been talking about this bill. Um, and, and I, you know, some people have raised a concern over some of these criminal penalties. But when you, when you look at these, the, the standard by which um, Senator Pizzo defines these things, I mean, I'm looking at line 231 knowingly willfully and repeatedly violates uh, the provisions of the act um 
you know, it, it, oftentimes, and I have many uh, condo associations in my district and uh, understand the management uh, perspective, but there, there is abusive behavior. Mm -hmm. and, and this bill does good things in requiring records to be posted and kept in an orderly fashion and provides access to those records by members of associations. Uh, and so, you know, if people are knowingly, willfully, and repeatedly ignoring the law, I think there should be some kind of penalty involved. And so um, thank you, Senator Pizzo, for this uh, bill. Uh, I'll be voting yes. Is there any additional debate on this bill as amended? I'll be. Senator Brandis, you are recognized. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. And, and obviously, I have some con concerns about the criminal penalties as well. I'm going to support Senator Pizzo to get it through here today. I think it was President Gates that said that he, he believed that most condo boards were essentially divisions of al-Qaeda um, and that... Um, um, and, and clearly, there are some bad actors within those within um, those sleeper cells. But we, um, I think, we can we can continue to work through this issue. And and um, always love having a bill out there with a broad title like condo associations. That just seems like we can do so much with that great title um, to address many of the issues that affect condo boards. So look forward to to supporting this bill and getting it through to the next committee so we can address some of the <laughs> glaring challenges that it has. Thank you. Thank you. Is there additional additional debate on the bill as amended? Um, Lynn, please call the roll on CS for CS for Senate Bill 610. Senator Bracey? Yes. Senator Bradley? No. Senator Brandis? Yes. Senator Brainin? Yes. Senator Farmer? Yes. Senator Gibson? Senator Hudson? Yes. Senator Pasadamo? No. Vice Chair Benequisto? Chair Simpson. Yes. Um, by your vote, CS for CS for Senate Bill 610 is reported favorably. Thank you, Mr. Chair. Thank you, Mayor.